We turn now to a developing story out of Greenwood as police are investigating the city's very first homicide of the year. It happened in an apartment complex near US 31 and Fry Road, and tonight the suspected gunman is still on the loose. RTV6 reporter Chance Walser has the latest on the investigation. We try to watch out, and if somebody's in trouble, we want to help. Deborah McGee is describing where she lives, the kind of complex where people look out for each other, where gunshots are not heard, where police are rarely seen. Today is the unfortunate exception. I just pulled up and saw the cop cars. We received a call of multiple shots fired at this address. When police got inside the Greenwood apartment, they found a man dead on the floor. All things point to homicide. Greenwood's first of the year. It'll scare some people. Um, you know, this was not at this time something we believe was a random act of violence. Investigators say the victim does not live in the apartment. Apparently, neither does a suspected shooter who witnesses describe as a black man around 30 years old. People saw him running from the complex wearing plaid shorts, white tennis shoes, carrying a bag. Police are looking for him now hoping his capture will reduce some of the fear neighbors are not used to feeling. You see it on the news for everywhere else, and you don't really think about it happening in your own backyard. That was Chance Walser reporting. Tonight, police ask if you think you've seen or know the whereabouts of the man fitting the description you just heard. Call Crime Stoppers at 262-TIPS.